Okay everyone, welcome back to an episode of Horizon Zero Dawn. I worked out how to get up here, finally, so I haven't actually gone a lot further than you saw. Uh, I've just climbed up that little area that I was at. Alright, got here. Where are we going? It's kind of a weird place actually. Yeah, there was, where I was, there was one of those little orange or like yellow boxes that I had to jump onto and I didn't notice it. So I probably spent about 20 plus minutes, maybe, trying to work out how to do that bit. Uh, right, where am I going? Oh, okay, across it. Yeah, I did come up here, but I ended up falling off. I don't remember how I fell off. Oh, like that. Okay. Is this even where I'm going? I'm going up here. Nice. This actually looks like quite a cool area. Oh, so I literally could have climbed up there and just... Okay, that's fine. <laughs> yeah, I just went the long way around. Yeah, either way, I'm still here. The way up. All oh. it takes is a few good handholds. That is very true. Up we go. Ooh, we're very high now. Alright. Made it. It's kinda of weird. Yeah, so last episode it was I was recording for about two hours and the PlayStation only records for like one hour at a time, so when it stops recording it has been erased from this device. Do you wish to deploy other privileges to recover virtual damage? Oh yes, I believe I do. A file has been recovered. Yeah, it was, it cut out and the audio went really weird and then it had issues with the audio coming out of the TV into the headset, so it's just, I had to take out all of the audio and video because it just, it wasn't well, working. Good to, uh... It's been years. Where's your legal team, Ted? No need. I dropped all 18 lawsuits the moment you landed. I assume your daddy confirms this. All right, this promises to be interesting. Perhaps we could have lunch brought in. You know, get reacquainted. I know you, Ted. You screwed something up to something big or you wouldn't have eaten the crow necessary to get me here. So spit it out. There's a glitch. In the chariot line. You're killing robots? Peacekeepers, yes, those. So shut them down. <laughs> Obviously, Liz, we would if we could. They're not responding. Are you telling me a swarm has gone rogue, Ted? It's worse than that. <sighs> Show me the data then. And we'll take that lunch alone. Ted Faro brought Elizabeth Sobek mm -hmm. here. But they hated each other. Yes, as well. Okay. I'll check that in a minute. Oh, I already came for it. Yeah, the PlayStation is super noisy. I'm trying to fix that. It's definitely quieting down a bit. But I'm trying to see if there's a way that I can cut the sound out of it. But I don't know how to do it. If someone does, let me know, because I really want to get rid of that sound. This isn't a glitch. It's a catastrophe. Fully aware. It's bad. Bad? Jesus, Les. It's not bad, Ted. It's apocalyptic. You built a line of killer robots. Peacekeepers. That consume biomass as fuel. In emergencies. And you made them capable of self-replication. Limited, self-manufacture, controlled. Not anymore. The glitch severed chain of command. The only nation this swarm answers to now is itself. You, you think I did? Everything else is just food. And at the rate it's replicating, Ted, it will strip the Earth bare in 15 months. We're not talking fall of civilization. We're talking extinction. I get it, Liz. So how do I stop it while it's contained? It's not contained. It can't be. You know what I mean. 
Wait. Before the truth kicks out, you mean. Chris, I will do anything you say. Keep working it, and whatever you recommend, I'll do. I'm gonna hold you to that, Ted. Interesting. Does it still need to watch? Oh, oh, oh. I don't need traps. Somehow she defeated them. I pretty much the never used them. Fell, but life went on, or we wouldn't be here. Okay, okay. Oh, how many files do you want me to watch? Right, let's watch this next one. Project Zero Dawn. Jesus, Liz. There has to be another way. If there were a nicer way to fix your mess, I would have proposed it. But this? This? When I asked you to find a cure, I didn't expect it to be worse than the disease. It's not, Ted. It may be grim, but it's our only chance. Now sign the proposal. Sign it? I can't sign that. Yes, you can. That? Liz, I cannot in good conscience sign that. You've got a choice, Ted. I know. I'm speaking to you from a VTOL en route to US Robot Command. In 15 minutes, I meet with General Harris and the rest of the Joint Chiefs. What? what? Are you crazy? Now your choice is what I tell them. Sign, and I'll tell them the wealthiest corporation on Earth has guaranteed the funds necessary to build Zero Dawn. Exactly as I've designed it. Or don't sign, and I will make sure they and everyone else on this planet knows the real cause of the glitch. Jesus, Liz. You don't have to threaten me. I'll sign. Look on the bright side, Ted. From here on out, you get to do what you've always been good at. Footing the bill while others get their hands dirty. Is that it? Okay. Yay, yeah, I really hope that's it for the holograms. What does she do to stop the robots? Executive access detected. Yeah. This, this doesn't add up. Sobek couldn't have been my mother. She lived ages ago. All this searching and I'm still no closer. Is that your reaction to everything you've just learned? To whine like a spoiled child? <sighs> you should really try talking that way to me face to face. As you wish. Do you really have no idea? How monumental are the discoveries you just made, Aloy? I expected more of you. So, you have a face. Got a name to go with it? Of all the questions you could ask right now, that's the one you choose. I've spent decades searching the ruins of the old ones, trying to solve the mystery of what happened to them. For years, I've suspected that Thel robots destroyed their civilization, but I could never confirm it. And in minutes, you uncover more ancient knowledge than I have in a lifetime, and what you want to know is my name. Silence. That's my name. Now, why don't you try asking that question? Something less trivial. Uh, let's do this one. If you're so smart, why do you know so little after a lifetime scratching around in the dirt? It's not my fault you're bad at what you do. I came to these ruins looking for Elizabeth Sobek, not because of the things she did centuries ago, but because people are trying to kill me right now, today. I've got bigger problems to deal with than your crap. Congratulations. You just graduated from Wyman to throw in a temper tantrum. I'm sure Elizabeth will be proud. You need to get a grip on yourself and start thinking straight. Only then will you see just how big your problems really are. What exactly are you talking about? You've chased a personal riddle into a crowd of larger mysteries. The common thread is your connection to Elizabeth Subic. But what is that connection? She couldn't have been my mother if she lived centuries ago. We don't know the connection yet. The only way to find out is to keep going, to keep making discoveries. Thanks to you, 
We've only just now learned that feral robots once threatened to end life on Earth. But it didn't happen. The Old One's civilization was destroyed, but life... life was saved. Obviously. So, what did Elizabeth do? How did she stop the robots before all was lost? What was Project Zero done? Exactly the question. Now, are you ready to go get the answer? Of course I am. And why are you still standing here? You're insufferable, you know that? Let's get on with this. Elizabeth told Ted Faro she was headed for a place called the U.S. Robot Command to tell people about Zero Dawn. The place still exists, as a rule. The Asuram call it the Grave Horde. Grave Horde? Share your name. You'll find it in the Eastern Mountains, buried under the tangled coils of a metal devil or a BOR civil horse, whatever as we're meaning to call it. I'll contact you when you get there. I can't wait. Someday when okay. Person, Let's when do it. Oh. That always worries me when she does that. Well, getting down will be a lot faster than getting up here. That's true. US will back command next. Oh. Tell me the secrets of Zero Dawn. Cool. Where am I going? My. I certainly didn't see this way. Okay. Ooh. More supply crates. Okay. Well, keep my stomach quiet. <laughs> yeah, so in the last episode, obviously my order isn't working, uh, but I didn't know when I was doing that fight with the death bringer, I think it was called, I didn't know you can make health potions. So there's me the entire way through the game. It's like, oh yeah, I need to find these plants so that I can keep healing myself, and I didn't know I could make potions. But now I do. So hopefully I don't die as often. So we're going to the Grave Horde. Oh no. See if I can corrupt this. Wait. Oh my god, I can override this. So will it follow me? No, it's not gonna follow me, is it? That's kind of a shame. It was pretty cool. I wonder how she knows where she's going. They're inside too. Like, obviously we have press markers. But like, 
in this situation, you wouldn't have somewhere tame to go. So how does she know where to go? Turning back. There is a lot going on here. Like a lot of dead people with recognisable things on them apparently. Don't need that. Are these like meant to be actual robots or are they just like some sort of weird tanks? I don't know. This will help. Right, I'm gonna pick up the rest. Oh no! What? No. Oh, well you you got hit by your own robot, so Right. Axe you. Axe you. How are you not dead? like he was regaining health. That was very confusing. I don't even know where they came from actually. They kind of just appeared. I uh, don't need any more health potions. Oh my god, I'm stuck. Yay, I'm out. Okay. Right, I don't think I missed anything else in here. Operation Enduring Victory. <gasps> oh! I did not realise that there was a, a rope above my head to swing down from. I just thought I had to jump. And now I'm dead. That is... Oh, really? Oh, that's where they were. They were actually here all along. Was that all through the oh actually use this so that I don't kill myself. Cause that would not be a good idea. Right, where are we going in here? I'm not really too bothered about the audio files. It's it's kind of just extra stuff. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's kind of weird. Surely metal furniture can't be that comfortable. Light. I guess that means power. Okay. The story feels kind of confusing so far. I don't know if it's just me. Oh, make it! Oh, look at that. I haven't seen any of these since I was a little kid. Oh. There must be some kind of code. Maybe I should try scanning objects in this area. Useful information. Oh wait. So it's like open, top, down, left, right. So top. So then this one needs to be down. This one needs to be on the left. And this one needs to be on the right. Three power lines, resources. That makes one. Wait, is there more that I have to open? I see a ladder. Oh no! Oops. Well, I guess that's one way of getting down the ladder. Up, up, down, down. Okay, so up, up. And then down. 
This puzzle's on actually as hard as I was expecting it to be. That's two. So now I just gotta do this one. I don't know, you kinda think they might be a little bit harder? Oh no. This one is broken. Geotherm system reboot goes like this. Bird flies north in summer, east in spring, west in fall, and south in winter. Didn't expect to hear nature poetry from the lips of Mike the GT Tech now, did you? As usual, I defy expectations. Wait, what did he say? It was like the north, east, southwest, right? East. I think. Or was it this one down? Yeah, look at that. Okay, I couldn't remember if he said south and last or third, so. Well, that's fine, I got it. Okay, open. Okay, some kind of power cell. I wonder what it's hmm. for. Whoa, that's them, all right. They're not looking for answers, just weapons. Right? Yeah. Look a lot. Oh. It's down. No. Really? It didn't die? Or is that a second one? Oh no, it's the second one. Make it Ooh. gives me a heart attack every time she does that. Yeah, so I'm not sure. I kind of want to do something similar to this. There's a few games I have in mind. <coughs> like, uh, I want to do the Far Cry games, maybe Control, because I got that. I've not played that yet. Um, I got it on PlayStation now, but I haven't played it. So. Because I want to do games I haven't played before. Because um, I don't want to just kind of do games I've already played. Because then I feel like it's kind of boring. Like on my Twitch, I generally do games I've already played. But on here, like this is brand new. What is this? So I'm not sure. Yeah. It's a map. A map of what? Let me get this. A world. The planet Earth, Eagle. It's not flat like you thought. Why would I think that? During eclipses, the shadow cast on the moon is curved. So our world is a globe. Chilling. It is. We'll discuss this another time. Back to the matter at hand. Where far our robots were spreading across the world, eating everything up. Somehow, Elizabeth stopped them before it was too late. But how? Yes, how? There is a lot to figure out in this game. 
I don't know if anybody has any idea that this is Should have brought a card to this already. I don't know if anybody has any idea what is happening, but I'm kind of lost. Not gonna lie. I have no idea what's going on. Oh, I thought I'd turn on the access then. Whoa. What is that? The eclipse. Tampering with the metal devil. And I don't think they can break it, do they? I really hope I don't have to f watch out. Like that. I'm trying to see at the minute what does the most damage. I can use this. I probably should <laughs> I'm probably should have done more off of camera to upgrade my weapons and my armor before I came here, but I don't know. To be fair that I was getting myself into a huge boss fight. I think I'm just gonna stock up on as many of these ones as I can. And then I can use many the Precision arrows and the fire arrows. Oh, that's why I wanted. I have no idea how I'm going to survive this. I don't remember how to lay traps. Oh, okay. I may have to do this fight off of the camera because it is it's so difficult. Like, I have no idea genuinely how I'm going to do this. Because it's just like as soon as I get near it's it's gone and it's I have to redo all of this. So I didn't get a lot done today, but I am really I have been trying and this boss fight is really difficult, so I'm gonna probably do this off camera. If I do it I'll try and record it and put it in but I'm just gonna go do like a bunch of side quests level myself up a bit get some more stuff I don't actually know what the level requirement is 
for this uh, quest. It's only level 18 and I'm level 21. But this boss is extremely difficult. So I think I'm just going to come off camera. I'll try and record it and get it in. It probably won't be with the face cam and everything. It'll just probably be bits of me doing the fight. But yeah, I'm just going to go off, upgrade everything. And I'll get back to you either in this video or in another video on Thursday, is it? Yeah, on Thursday when I come back. And I'll be live tomorrow playing Outlast Whistleblower at 1pm GMT. Uh, Friday is... Where's Friday? Friday is Minecraft at the same time at 1. Saturday is, I think, Dead by Daylight, maybe Vigor. I think. So... I'll see you guys on Twitch or YouTube at some point this week. Bye guys.